say that every time because we don't know what else to say. But that doesn't make it any less true. Any less. Fun fact, I just realized. Super fun. Forgot to invite Joey again. <laughs> well, we're running out of episodes, so he doesn't have that many lives. I know. I uh, totally forgot. So. Sorry, Joey. Joey's not going to watch this. Joey's just this <laughs> mythical creature. Uh, he's the Joey, the actually. Joey. He's kind of like Cthulhu. The more you learn about him, uh, the, the more insane you become. Cthulhu. Uh, Lovecraft. That's a thing that I know <coughs> a little bit about, and that I know that people talk about Cthulhu, and I looked him up once. He's like a... He's like a spaghetti big squid monster. Spaghetti man. A big, <laughs> he looks like uh, Davy Jones from. He does look uh, exactly like that. That movie, Davy Jones. Is Davy in. Jones and his pirate pals. Yeah. <laughs> his merry band of pirates, <laughs> pirate pranksters. But uh, I guess I'm doing the same thing that I did. Just doing. running this L erection. So uh, the comfy maneuver. Shout out to. Shout the out to comfy, comfy maneuver, maneuver who definitely doesn't watch us. But I like the comfy maneuver. That's fine. It's I'm so just saying. Great. I love watching his videos. He's not watching us. He's watched a couple of our videos. How do you know that? Because he tweeted at us. Did he really? Uh, a long time ago. It might have just been a response to a tweet I did, but that doesn't sound like he watched. No, I us. think I think that's how I found him. Is that he? I think he was looking for uh, Vanger's videos. Vanger's? Because he, <laughs> I'm saying Vanger's. <laughs> because he also pronounces it the same way. Vanger's. Um, I think he was looking for those, because he plays Vangers too. Um, so it was either I was looking for other people playing it, or he was. It's a very select group. An yeah, elite group. Top small, man. Yeah, top notch. We're on the top tier of the internet. Yes, we are not in the underbelly. The right. seedy underbelly. <laughs> the seedy underbelly. <coughs> hey, you. hey well, now you're the coffee one. Coffee. <laughs> I don't drink coffee. Coffee is amazing. It's so good. Coffee's gross. So on my way over... To meet you to do this show, I was listening to Girl Talk for the first time in a long time. <laughs> the let, segue. Let me just say. The segue. Abruptly. <laughs> uh, that album, All Day, by Girl Talk, <clears throat> starts out awesome. Awesomely. In an awesome way. Awesome. Like, it's just, it's the track is called Oh No, and it's, uh, you know Girl Talk? I know Girl Talk. Okay, it's a mashup of War Pigs by... Um, What's the band? I had it. The one that, uh... <laughs> the one that Ozzy Osbourne was lead singer of Black Sabbath. Black so Sabbath. War Pigs. And then it's also mixed with, um, uh, Get Out the Way. Which I think uh, is DM- Jay- Who is that? Is it, is it DMX or is it Jay-Z? I think it's DMX, right? D- it seems like it's newer than DMX. Well, DMX is never really DMX gone. is, you know, y'all gonna make me lose my mind. Well, yeah. And get out the way is is all like move B, B we can curse on the show. Shh. So I think it's I think it's Jay Z. But I don't think so. The the mashup the mix is great. It's ludicrous. It's ludicrous. That's yeah. what I said. Jay Z crazy, <laughs> ludicrous. Um, so the, the the reason I like Girl Talk so much is because I I'm not that into rap. Yes. I like. How, wait. Well, I like <laughs> I like some rap, you know. I like. By the way, I, <clears throat> I, I'm sorry. I will let you get back to it really quickly. But I talked about the comfy maneuver for a reason. Oh, okay, sorry. He t- he said as a comment, he's like, maybe he should try jumping more. Jumping. So that was what I was trying to do. I was like, all right, just gonna jump. I'm just gonna jump to the finish. <laughs> <laughs> gonna just, do it. Just jump. Didn't work. Uh, Surprisingly. Yeah, I warned you. I said I don't. I, it worked for him, apparently. Right. Hey, I just wanted to try it. The jump function in this game is wildly erratic. I think also, and this might be a technical thing, and I might be talking out of my ass, but so the way keyboards work, the reason people like mechanical keyboards and stuff like that is because they have individual keys. Right. Like, they send it over serial, but they don't, like, all the I.O. is at one time. Okay. So when you're pressing a key and you can press another key, they both register. Right. Um, a lot of keyboards to save... Uh, like circuitry and complexity and stuff, they create like a matrix. So it just keeps sweeping across the cre- keys by like one row. So if you press like W and or A and Q, if they're in the same column, then only one of those will register. Oh, okay, right, right, right. Or if you press like 
So it just kind of sweeps through. Okay. So if you have a bad keyboard and you're trying to hold multiple keys down, right. it might so not jumping. work. So it could be like boom, boom, boom. That's boom, what happens boom. to you when you're jumping. I don't know if it's a keyboard or not. It might not be. I uh, that that makes sense. Um, I the the jump it's it's the kid it's the kid uh what's it called. I just the kid function or the kid uh, device KID is what the jump thing is called in this game. Oh, okay. Like kinetic something something. It's it's an acronym, but it is so tricky to get right to get your jumps right in this game. Oh yeah, they it's terrible. It's really I, I feel <clears throat> like I've got it pretty down. Like I can do some good jumping, but only like half the time. The trajectory is just like, it's, I mean it's even rough. the computer's just like whoa. Yeah. Dude. It's really hard, um, and so I only really use it to get out of jams. You know, if I'm, like, rolled over or if someone's shooting me. Um, but anyway, uh, okay, girl rap. talk. Rap. So I like some rap. I listen to Kid Cudi. I like Kid Cudi a lot. I like um, some Kanye, but I think Kanye's a jerk, so I don't... He is a because complete of that, ass. It sours the music for me. I really like Sage Francis. Um, I like... Uh, Lupe Fiasco. Lupe Fiasco, for sure. Super good. But so I'm not that into a lot of rap because it's just like, oh, I don't want to listen to someone... Just saying a bunch of cuss words to music, mm -hmm. but when you mix it with a sweet rock jam, like like it's the early 1990s. Man, I get super into that. Yeah, like Run DMC and Aerosmith, Linkin rocking Park. it out. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I, I just like really like that. So that's why Girl Talk for me is really great because it's like I'm, but I feel weird listening to it really loud with the windows down because it's. I think super from that same obscene. same perspective. Same type of music, the mashup. Yeah. Uh, Super Mash Brothers. They're really good. Super good. Legion of Doom is really good. Not heard Legion of Doom. Legion of Doom is. Good. Uh, I don't know how many. I just have the one album by them, or him. I don't know how many dudes it is, but there's a really good mashup. It's Sage Francis and Dashboard Confessional. Really I don't good. know what style they have there. Sage Francis is a rapper. And no, I know. It's the but song. like, am I like doing black hair sweeping? With dashboard, or am I doing? Oh right, <laughs> um, the the song is called uh, "Hands Down Gandhi," and so it's a mashup of uh, "Hands Down" by Dashboard and "Slow Down Gandhi" by Sage Francis. It's an excellent, it's an excellent. There's mashup. a. I'm going to be putting in annotations for all these songs. By the way, listen up. Can Welcome we to our new show. Can we put links to YouTube videos. In yeah. Anything? All right, sweet. That's, That's almost do. exclusively what we can put. Yeah, links we to. can't put links to anything else. Yeah. Um, also, uh, there's a funny, I think it was done as a joke, but it's actually pretty good. Um, there's a, a famous album, Neutral Milk Hotel, did an album called In an Aeroplane Over really the Sea. Really good, really good album. Really good album. But they mixed it, somebody like remixed it with a bunch of like sweet rap tunes. Oh yeah. And, uh, the, do, you, do you know the album? sounds like a dinosaur. Do you know the album? Look out, there's a bunch of rap tunes. <laughs> do you know the album cover with like that lady? It's like a painting. Yeah, thing. she's pointing or something. So the name of the album is In a, in a G4 Over the Sea. <laughs> <laughs> and the lady's head, like they made her boobs bigger. Okay. And then they, on her head is just a big rim. <laughs> That's her head. <laughs> like a basketball and, rim? Yeah. Well, no, no, no. Not like a basketball. Like a car. Oh, a car. Like a chrome yeah, I, was, rim. I don't know why I went to basketball. <laughs> um, I'm a b-boy. And it was just, it's really great. Because it's just such a weird is album it, to it, pick. Is it a good mix though? Yeah. There's some good stuff on there. there it's not all solid. But because there are some, good some of those album projects don't really hit. I, I was really excited about the Grey album, which is Jay-Z and the White I album. I like the Grey album. I think Danger Mouse. Yeah, I think it's so boring. Oh, well. Because I really wanted more <clears throat> Beatles. You know, I wanted to hear a lot of Beatles in there, but it's like... It's Jay-Z's Black Album acapella with... Yeah, remix. and man, I did not, I did was, not enjoy that it. That came out on Grey Tuesday, I think. Yeah, I didn't and like it. And it. Like, it was like a big thing on oh, the your, internet. Oh, your video's I'm over. done, man. I didn't win. You didn't win that time. I didn't win the game. Uh, big surprise. So, oh, I don't know I'm why hurt. I came. I think I came here just my to charge my, uh, <laughs> my gorbs. So, I'm going back to Glorks. And what did I do last time? I went to Boozina. I got the Mechanic Messiah. I lost it. Yeah, you don't have it anymore. You tried to get it, like, pretty bad. I was bad. too big. You are too big and dumb. So, okay. So, what I have left to do is deliver... Stand, all, stand and deliver. <laughs> deliver all those dudes in a box to all the secondary worlds, and then I can get the key to Hmok. So are we going to a new world this episode? I don't think so. I think that's like that's like one of the last things you do. Go to Hmok, get the spummy, um, and then... Spummy? That sounds disgusting. It's a like mummy. It, it sounds like... 
Uh, but it's a spume. Spume. <laughs> Smegma. Uh, no. <laughs> no. Uh, Don't look that up on okay. Google. That's the word. <laughs> um, but uh, it's just the way you end the game. That's yeah. how you end any conversation <laughs> is with that <laughs> word. So Hamak is a uh, one of those secondary worlds, but it's you can't. There's no passage to it. You have to have the function 83 plus. So okay. You have to have that item to get there to beat the game. So it's a crucial item to have. It's Krush. <laughs> Krush. So crushed it. Crushed it. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. What am I doing with my life? Uh, I'm floating. What, um, am I, what am I doing right now? Being a derp. So oh, there's the mechanic messiah. Can't get it. I think I'm going to try to pick it up again. Stuck forever. Yeah, there's no way. You gotta Hoover that up, and you don't have the Hoover. Function. I think I'm gonna try. Oh, that's why. So I went to Incubator, the fossil, so I could get the crot rig, so I could dig. So I just dug my way underground, right? Uh huh. And I'm gonna try to come back out of the ground through the item. You yeah, got it. Picked it up. Uh, you didn't even remember you be, you picked no, it up. I didn't remember, but that's an old trick we use all the time. Because um, items always fall in little crevices like this, so if you get the crot rig, you can dig your way out of the ground and uh, come up through an item and pick it up. We bring you and your brothers. Yes, that's what I mean by me. <laughs> me and uh, my older brother, my younger brother wasn't that into video games. So just me and. Speaking of into video bro. games, uh, went to a sweet arcade yesterday. <coughs> that was the response I was hoping for. Sorry. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, me and a friend went to, um, if you're in or near Illinois, near Chicago-ish area. I'm not. Uh, yeah. <laughs> We're kind of, it's kind of out of the way. Um, but in Brookfield, like where the zoo is. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, there's a sweet arcade called Galloping Ghost, and they have, uh, like, some ridiculous number of games there. That's awesome. Uh, just awesome. 15 bucks play all day, and you can leave. How long are they out. open? Uh, 11 to 2. Dude. That yeah. sounds cool. It's awesome. How long were you there? Uh, yeah, let's see. We got there about, I want to say like oh. 2, 2 or 3, and we left about 9. That's fun. Yeah. It's, it feels like it'd be an awesome place to have a birthday party. Yeah, I don't know if they do. They do tournaments but, I mean, just to go yeah. Oh, yeah. with people. And it was packed. All right, so I'm taking the Mechanic Messiah to 3 all. Because last time I was here, he said, where's your Mechanic Messiah object? He called me an object. Uh-huh. I assume he's saying, not like the, calling me one. But I decided to bring it to 3-all. Um, so he would maybe tell me how to win the game the evil way. And? And we'll see. I'm waiting with bated breath. Bait your breath. How are you deflecting those? I turn a shield on with the protractor. Oh, Okay. So he says, detect a new reason the mechanic messiah is in touch with me. Like, what does that mean? Oh, it's like, sweet, yeah. Cool, cool message. Same thing. All right. Like, I'm pressing all the buttons right now. I'm like, space bar, enter. You know, this evil guy doesn't seem to really want the mechanic messiah too much. Right? He's just like, hey, sweet, bro. There it is. So the mechanic, the mechanic Messiah also has a function called luck. Did you notice that his circle is directly in an X? Yes. That was probably done on purpose. X marks the circle. It <laughs> um, has a function called luck, and if you use luck, you die. And really? I, yeah, it's... Um, it just, it, it like, splits you apart in a bunch of pieces, and then you get this weird error message, and the oh, game's over. Oh, that's kind of neat. Um, so, That'd be cool if it corrupted your save and you can yeah. go back. <laughs> um, but I think I might I might try it because I think uh, maybe that's what I'm supposed to do because it doesn't do anything else but kill you normally. So I thought maybe it'll work. I'm just, like right clicking it there. I'm not sure if I actually do try it, but if I don't, I'm I probably should like an idiot. I'm not gonna idiot. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna leave. You didn't even want to die. I guess not. I bet it doesn't work, though. There's like an item out there in the lava. You should go get it. I should probably go get it. <laughs> it's probably safe. Just float my way out there. 
float my way back. You get that big hunk of truck. Hunk of truck. You're good. <clears throat> You're Gucci. Truck is hot. Hot trucks. Hot trucks. Welcome to Hot Trucks Talk. Hot trucks with <laughs> Matt and Tim. Ooh, hot. my name's first this time when we're talking about <laughs> hot trucks. <laughs> we're moving up. <laughs> We should switch up our name every every series. Well, Matt, Matt, Matt. someone did mention, he's like, why isn't your name first? I'm like, because it doesn't matter. Who, who, who did that? I don't remember. I When we started, I was like, what should we, whose name should we put it first? Didn't, it doesn't like matter. So, <laughs> it doesn't matter. Who's the more important one? It doesn't matter. Well, I mean, it's me, I guess. That's fine. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's not. Uh, there's, there's no real reason. <laughs> yeah. I guess alphabetically, I th- your I name think, comes I think, first. I um, think... The way it sounds, Tim Man instead of Matt and, you know, like... That's fine. Tim and Matt play. It, Matt and Tim play. I get almost never bent out of shape about that sort of stuff. Yeah, I know. Like, it, does, pe- it totally doesn't matter. Do, yeah. People get, like, huge egos. Like, I really oh, don't even God. care. All right, so I went back to him. Uh-huh. He told me... The old one. What did he tell me to do? He told me to go get something. I went to 3 Oh, he told me to go 3 all and check something out, so... Told now you he's to gonna, get a life. He's going to tell me all this huge story about, like, the back story of the worlds and the plot <laughs> he's like now uh, is the exposition yeah it's a lot of it and i'm just looking for the thing he tells me to do so i can say it on this video uh uh-huh. uh uh-huh. did somebody say somebody said something recently to me like instead of the plot thickens they said something else like the plot weakens maybe or the plot uh I'm liking this story already. I don't know what it was. It was funny, though. It was funny. Insert laugh here. <laughs> we need a little laugh track button. I would love to get a little soundboard well, where we could do, like... I'll, I'm going to find one on the internet. Hang on. Yeah, but it's going to be, like, through a cell phone speaker. <laughs> As opposed to what? Directly recording to the audio track. Oh, well, we can do it in post. We can do everything in post. We'll do it on the day. Ooh, soundboard.com. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh. Huh? No. No, that's not it. You must have already visited the small mystical worlds. Uh, the world's change depending on cycle. Relationship. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Only seven SKs have survived. Those are the ones you can go to and buy stuff in. Four small worlds may be suitable for life. Weeks out, Cox, Boozina, Ark is Noi. I don't know how any of those worlds are suitable for life. Because they kill people right away. The Ark But it's because they don't have larvae on them that he wants them to break away from the larvae. So, um, he says to... Um, he says something to check something out. Um... Take at least one passenger from each S cave. So just one from each one. And then um, take at least one to each world. So when I first played this game, I thought that meant take one from every S cave to each world. Oh, so like take one deliver? So I delivered seven dudes to every uh, of those worlds. But you just have to take at least one. So you just take... Seven, and then distribute them amongst the four worlds. Doesn't matter. Are you trying for biodiversity? Many. Yeah, I think I just <laughs> drop them wherever. And with the func with the uh, function eighty three plus, it's really fast. So, is that just the warp function? Thank you. That was a Thank del- you. a delay <laughs> a delay in that. <laughs> Ooh. Thank you. <laughs> oh, I've got the... What do I have? Is it because I have the Mechanic Messiah? Plague Carrier? Take, oh, probably. Yeah, he's mad at me. I hate it when Finger's mad at me. Look at his face. Get out of here. And then he goes into his little body. All right, that's my video. So next time I think I start collecting uh, passengers and distributing them. Next we, time. We got three left. Yeah, on the next Four time. Four left. On the next time, next time! <laughs>